In order to compete in any sport at Princeton, but in particular in basketball, um, teamwork is paramount. And every day you learned how to depend on teammates. Success was driven by the team. It was about aligning around a common goal. And since graduation, I found that those principles apply just as much in your career after Princeton as they do when you're competing in athletics here. And what mentoring is really about is for the current student athletes, and by the way, young alumni, to know that there is a team out there to support them. As an underclassman, I think you're focused on you know, academics and how am I going to get by in this class, or you know, you're worried about the basketball piece, and you're just focused on making shots and guarding your man. You're not really thinking about life after basketball. So it, it kind of serves to come in and give you that perspective early and, and lets you know of your options. You have the support system here, and we're here to help you and um, really just puts those things on your radar that maybe you're not thinking about quite yet. We can bring dozens of alumni back at any time and we have close to 100 alumni out there to take a phone call, to be able to mentor one-on-one, -on -one, to be able to and potentially even align with a job opportunity um, is very, very powerful. So the words are important, the actions are more important. And I think that's what makes mentoring special. The, the mentor program generally, like. The, the, it's filled with so many people that are so talented and so smart and so bright. And again, we have access to all of them. So in the same way that Frank is able to help you, someone who maybe just graduated can help you. Maybe someone who's 10 years out can help you. And they can give you their perspective and their experiences. And it's really, really invaluable. Welcome to Hankel Fieldhouse on the campus of Butler University. Derek Jones and Noah Savage with you for 103.3 WPRB Princeton. Two, two minutes in. Kennedy, healthy three, connects. Uh -huh. Evan Kennedy. Brennan pops a three, knocks it down. All net for Alec Brennan. Stevens catches with six. Down to three, Stevens. Works left, drops it in. Ah. Nice move from Miles Stevens. Ooh, Bell in the lane, drives with the right hand. What a move by Amir I Bell. Mean, oh, man. Dirty, in and out, and then he beat two guys in the help. But you can't make it that easy for him. 61-54. Make it 61-57 as Kennedy drills a three. Kennedy from the parking lot. Martin with a rebound, and that'll do it. The Tigers gave it a go, but in the end, could not overcome a tough effort by the Butler Bulldogs. They went in 85 to 75 to move to 2-0. The Tigers dropped to 0-1 in their season opener. They will move forward to Wednesday night to open up matters at Jadwin Gymnasium against the BYU Cougars.